Hi, today we're going to make the turkey and ham puff pastry pinwheels. All you're going to need is two sheets of puff pastry, a 9 ounce container of thinly sliced turkey breast, an 8 ounce container of thinly sliced ham, divided both of them divided in half, and a package of sliced mozzarella with 12 slices. Okay, first what you're going to do is you're going to get your puff pastry and unfold it, taking out the parchment paper on a lightly floured surface. Then you're just going to want to kind of take away the little creases that are in it. Then you're going to want to flatly place your turkey along the whole thing. just like that then you're going to want to add your cheese evenly kind of overlapping a little bit Just like that. Then once you got that on, you're going to want to add your ham. And you'll do the ham just like you did the turkey. Just like this. Okay, and then once everything is in, you're going to want to start rolling it as tight as you can. Pushing everything in so it don't come out until you get a big log. Once you got your big log, you get a serrated knife. You cut it in half and you cut each side in three sections and you're going to cut each of those sections in half just like so And this is a good idea for a quick meal for school, um, football parties. And then after that, you just place it on a lightly greased cookie sheet. And I've placed parchment on it. And I'll finish plating these and I'll be right back. Then next you get one egg and a little bit of water. And you just kind of mix it to make an egg wash. Just like so. Making sure you break up all of that white gooey stuff in there. The next, get a basting brush and you just brush them with the egg wash. Just like that. Then once we've got them all brushed very well, this is when you can put sesame 
seeds or anything you want. I'm actually going to put some everything bagel seasoning on a few of these just for added flavor and savoriness. Just like that. Now I'm going to pop them in my ov my preheated oven that's been preheating at 400 degrees. I'm going to keep them in there for about 15 minutes or until they start browning and get a golden brown. We'll be back. Okay, they're done. Let me show you one. This is what they look like. Nice and flaky. These are perfect for football parties. Look at that. Um, Get-togethers, anything that you need something to bring quick. They look like you spend all day with it and it doesn't take long to make. If you have any questions, you can text me down below or um, private message me too if you have any questions. Also, um, my vlogs are going to be coming back as often as I can do them. They uh, do take a long time making them and then editing them and everything. So they'll be coming back as often as I can. If you have any questions again, like I said, comment below. And I hope everybody has a great weekend. Thank you.